Gina, we're here talking with Peter, and he is so sweet. He is so sweet. He was actually an owner surrender. He's a Westie mix, we think. He's very cute. He needs a good grooming, good bathing. Um, he's embarrassed now. Um, he's about two to three years old, and he would make a wonderful addition to any family. He gets along good with dogs, loves kids, loves people. Loves microphones, yeah. <laughs> Listen, he's so cute. This was a, a came in with another dog. A, maybe an owner uh, couldn't take care of him anymore. Yeah, just couldn't take care of him. Um, I don't even. They were moving to Dallas. Was their the reason? They're moving to Dallas and needed to get rid of him. So here he is, and he's looking for a new home. Well, we wanted folks to know that on Saturday, Valentine's Day, there is a sweet little deal that y'all have. Yes, going. come find the love of your life. Oh, um, okay. we um. We haven't in the past had our foster program has only been for sick or injured animals and nursing mothers, but we've uh, expanded it quite a bit. We have a new assistant director named Robin, and she's uh, got lots of dogs and cats in foster. So this weekend we're bringing all, well, not all of them, we're bringing select foster dogs to the shelter for you to adopt, and they're $14 a piece. Oh, wow. Yeah, that, in, that includes everything. They're spare neuter, first set of shots, microchip, all of that. So. Yeah, come find the love of your life. Well, we don't want you to forget also on the 20th of February, they're going to draw a name for a big Bissell vacuum carpet cleaning. Pet awesome. vacuum. Pet mm -hmm. vacuum. Yes, it's okay. a pet vacuum. <laughs> and the tickets are a great price. Tickets are a dollar. Yeah, one dollar for a chance to win. And you can, um, if you do call in and use a credit card, you have to buy at least five tickets. But if you come in, you can spend a dollar, spend 20, spend whatever you want. Well, it's a great way and uh, keep that hair. I, I brush my dog all the time, but I mean, it's tough. You got a, an extra vacuum, but these are just ways that the Humane Society needs your help so much in donations. And I love it when I'm, when I'm here and folks walk in, they just put money in your uh, box in there. In the box. Nice. And we do, um, we are not a part of the Humane Society of the United States. That is a common misconception. Um, local humane societies are not a part of that. It's, a, it's considered a parent organization, but we're not affiliated with them at all. So all of your donations stay in the panhandle and, and to help the animals here. So nice. You heard it here, Gina. Thank you so much. Thank Look you. on your screen. Come see us. The Amarillo Panhandle Humane Society needing your help. Little Peter. Come on, Peter. He needs your help.